So I'm building this rack and I've got this old hose reel. It's off an old fire truck I bought a six by long gone 30 years ago. Been sitting in the woods. What am I gonna do with it? Well, I think it's some kind of Ferris wheel, but we'll see how it looks. So I'm working on my plant Ferris wheel here. I got the brackets welded in and I have this old uh, slide out motor. I took off my motor home. It actually, the little hold down spring broke and it unplugged so it's still good. So I wired it in and uh, here's a test. Check that out. Isn't that cool? Not gonna have it spin all the time. I think just turn it maybe when you gotta water it or something. And I don't know, we'll see. I don't know where it's going. Anyways, cool. Well, here we go. Here's the finished product, the garden wheel. It's uh, cable spools on the side of the road. I had to do something with it. It's kind of fun. I did this little uh, 5 watt solar panel. It keeps the battery charged. And uh, seems to work pretty cool. <laughs> Enjoy. gave this to my neighbor because uh, all these bolts came from a bucket she had in her garage and uh, thought it was fitting she got something out of it so then she painted it livened it up pretty nice didn't it Well, here's the stairs at night. Lights it up pretty good. I wish they were a little dimmer. But, uh, you know, you don't really know. I had to uh, splice. It comes four pigtails, four lights for each ballast. And I had to uh, lengthen them to make it work on the stairs. But it worked out pretty good, I think. So here's the sign at night. Just two old shelves I found laying in the woods and uh, laid out the wolf and cut it out, I think. You know, always when you make something, I wish I would have made the wolf a little longer. But, I don't know. That's what I did. Worked out.
So I'm working on a gas fire pit. Bottom of a wheel cut off. The bottom of a, well, half a wheel. And then the bottom of a electric hot water heater. Cutting some shapes in it. And I'll show you a little more progress as we go. Well, I don't know if the flames will show up. I didn't want to wait till night. There it is. I just put a, I had rocks in the bottom, but I went ahead and put a, a screen and then put this glass. You buy it at Home Depot. That way it, uh, it's not so heavy, you can move it around. This is my uh, son's deck. Pretty nice view. Cloudy and rainy today though. I'm pouring some uh, patio blocks here. And I wanted moose tracks in them, so I saved an old moose. <laughs> Got to do them all the same way and I'll make it look like it's running through the patio. Fine art to this. Yeah, right. Maybe if I do this and put some bear bait, I can get bear tracks. I know this isn't art, but I wanted to share this with you. This is a 4-2. Some people call them lean-tos, but this is my fourth lean-to on this shop. 24 by 32 shop. 
So I have a lean-to over there for our motorhome. I got one here. It's two levels. And now we're building another, and I have one out back. So it's a 4-2. Hardy har har.